because uh, there's a lot of uh, experts in gemology, the leaders in gemological and jewelry field also attend our uh, conference. 今天呢，真的是一个盛世，因为我们有很多宝石学的专家，还有呢，就是宝石行业一些领先的领导在场。It uh, is round about two years ago when I uh, met the friends in the jewelry show. 那两年前，我呢，在一个珠宝的展览当中呢，就碰到一位朋友。He uh, showed me something look unusual to me. 他賣了一些樣子看起來不尋常的東西給我。You know, although I work in the jewelry trade for at that time around about 36 years, but I haven't seen a, a kind of a gemstone like it. 那時候呢,我我已經在珠寶行業做了36年了,但是我從來沒有看過這樣子的一塊珠寶。And then he told me that uh, in the years about uh, 2013 he discovered something new uh, in Kenya. At the beginning, his family members tried to stop him because they think he's a little bit wrong in the mind. Because he's, he tried to insist he discovered something new in gemology of gemstone. And then after the jury show, I invite him to come to my office, and then I look at his product, and then I spend around $20,000 to him. And this is a new gem, gemstone called by him as Go Shin Sapphire. 那时候呢，在这个珠宝展览之后呢，呃，我呢就回到那个办公室，然后呢，我呢就看他的这一个呃产品，我花了两万元就买了。那这一块呢，就是他说是一个新的宝石，称为金光蓝宝石。呃，and uh, this gentleman, his name is Mr. Tan Sin Kang. 这位先生呢，他的名字是简泰森先生。the reason why I like to introduce his name is he is not trying to sell something expensive of his new discoveries. But as a gemologist, when we find something new, it is it is a kind of uh, it is a kind of motivation. You try to own something new. 作为宝石学家，当你发现新事物的时候呢，就是一种动机，因为你想拥有这个新的事物。This Gaussian sapphire, I measure by the refractometer, and then it is just the similar refractive indexes measure as by corundum. 啊，我呢用那个仪器去量度这个金光蓝宝石的双折射率，跟啊刚玉的是差不多的。and then, in order to confirm it is a kind of corundum, then I use UV visible spectrometer to look at the UV spectrum. As what we just heard from Richard, the 450 nanometer absorption band or lines will be a persistent line of almost all sapphire. 刚才听Richard说,这一个450纳米的这条线呢,应该是所有的蓝宝石的这条西光的那条线。And that is the 450 nanometer absorption line in Gaussian sapphire. 那这条就是在激光蓝宝石上那个450纳米的西光线。And then this is a closer look of this 450. Now, most gemologists may understand that we also can verify a minerals by using infrared spectrometer. So this is the uh, near this is the infrared spectrum of the Gaussian sapphire. It is just 
exactly the same as in coronum. Now look at the varieties of these uh, new varieties of corundum. As gemologists understand, the rare paparaja from Sri Lanka is a rare treasure of around about 20-30 years ago. But paparaja is not inexpensive. They are very expensive product. But gold sheen sapphire, they are quite reasonable in price. And the finished product will be ranged from a few carats to around 100 carats in size. Now, many people are looking for natural ruby, natural sapphire, do not evolve any thermal or heat enhancement. Ocean sapphire do not need this thermal enhancement. Sometimes the Goshen sapphire do display additional color beside the gold. Such as blue, green, pink, and gray color. Now, when we look at this Goshen sapphire beside the primary gold color, sometimes the color patterns resembling uh, the aurora uh, effect. So, a gemologist in America also call it an aurora sapphire. Now, there are a few uh, sample collection of mines, and I hope you have a look and then look at this interesting. Uh, uh, reflection pattern in the widget in Thailand, he describes it as a shimmering effect. It is 100% correct. And this is another collection of the Goshen Sapphire. Some other collection of Goshen Sapphire. Now, we, I also noticed there are some asterism noticeable from Goshen Sapphire, star effect. So the star effect noted from the Goshen Sapphire, I will translate it in Chinese as Jin Guang Xin Guang Nan Bao You know, I have a, I have a friend when he looked at this uh, Goshen Go star sapphire, he asked me. It is, is it what a similar gold color star sapphire from Chantaburi, Thailand? The gold color sapphire, the golden star sapphire from Chantaburi, Originally, they look blackish, 
。啊，原本的来自这个泰国的啊建建筑木建筑派建筑派，这个地方的呢是黑色的。Only the star will show in golden effect. 只有那个星星是金色的效果。But this golden star sapphire, the entire piece with golden reflection of light. 但是呢，这个金光是金光蓝宝石呢，是整块都是可以反射光的。And the gold and the gold star is actually on top of the gold sheen. 这个金色还有金色的星星呢，就是在整呃整个金光层上面的。So this is the collection of Goldshin star sapphire. 那这一个就是这个系列金光星光蓝宝石。And this is the certificate we make on this Goldshin star sapphire. 这个就是我们做的这个证书，是证明这个金光星光蓝宝石的。Now, I look at this. Uh, uh, I look at the Mr. Khan's collection. Suddenly, I discover. A pattern looking as more more like a profile of a diamond. 那么我看这个简先生他的呃收藏他的系列的话呢，突然间呢我就看到一个呃图案，看起来呢像钻石。And then this look like a diamond pattern or diamond side view when I magnify it under the microscope. 这里你可以看到，我把这一个钻石形状的部分呢，我用放大镜来去放大来看。Golden sapphire comes mostly near opaque. 这个金光蓝宝石呢，看起来呢就是不透明的。But this one, the center is a yellow sapphire, transparent. 但中央的这个部分呢，就是黄色蓝宝石。Chinese and some Asian. They like gold very much. Ah, Chinese people and also some Asian people are very fond of gold. Very fond of gold. Many people like the shining of diamond. Many people are very fond of gold shining. Now, gold and sapphire may be able to give us the two different appearances, including the golden color as well as the shining pattern. 那么这个金光蓝宝石呢，就两者都有，它可以给我们金色的颜色，还有呢就是很闪亮的效果。As a gemologist, sometimes we like to find something new. 作为宝石学家，很多时候我们都想找一些新东西。But not always you can find it. 但不是常常你都可以找到。But in this occasion. 但是在这里呢。Let me show you. One more new Goldshin Sapphire collection. 我再给你多看一个新的金光蓝宝石的系列。A Goldshin Sapphire with a not very good cutting of diamond profile, which is reddish color in the center. 那这里呢，就是一块金光蓝宝石，它的中间呢是有一个部分，它呃是红色的，但是不是切割的很好的那个钻石形状。Some people they wonder what make it gold. 有些人在怀疑啊，为什么可以是金色的呢 ？I think most likely it is something related to rutile inclusions. 呃，我觉得可能呢，都是因为里面的一些内含物。But rutiles come in two different colors, gold and reddish, isn't it? 但是这个金红石呢，有两个颜色呢，就是有金色和红色。But the reddish Goldshin sapphire is so rare. 红色的金光蓝宝石呢是非常稀有的。So this Goldshin sapphire with the reddish inclusion in there will be a very rare piece. 所以呢，这一块里面有金呃有红色的内含物呢是非常稀有。So I hope uh, this new gemstone will be uh, interest to some of you. 希望呢，你们对于这一块新的宝石会有兴趣。And I hope uh, the discoverer of this Goshin sapphire, Mr. Tan Sim Khan, may be able to discover later on a reddish Shin sapphire. 那么，呃，我也希望这一块金光蓝宝石的发现人简泰森先生呢，他稍后呢，可希望他发现这个呃红色金光红宝石。For those who come from Hong Kong and China.
And if you like to make some new business in Corondom family, besides Ruby and Sapphire, I strongly recommend maybe you can pay attention to this new variety of Corondom, Goshin Sapphire. So thank you very much for your attention.